Good day! Welcome back to my channel. This is Kuya Vince or Vincent Pleasure. Today I will be teaching you how to make my introduction. My introduction is called an avatar introduction. So if you want to learn it, please stay, <laughs> watch my video until the end because there will be lots of tricks and how to make it. And if you are new to my channel, please don't forget to like this video subscribe and hit that bell notification so that every time that I will be uploading new video you will be notified we will need for this tutorial an internet connection your cell phone your kind master application then we will be downloading an application from your Google Play Store so if you want to know what is that application Stay tuned and listen carefully for my instruction. First, we will have to open our Google Play Store so that we can download the application. Okay? In the search engine, we will have to type Super Me Comic Avatar Maker. That will be the application that we will be using. Then click search. Then the first one that will appear, top, that is the Super Mini Maker comic piece, so it's toilet. Once installed, open it. When you open the application of Super Me, you will see in the interface this part this section so you can choose which avatar you want it's either female or male so the left side is male at the right side is female so we will be using the male avatar okay once inside the uh, avatar maker you can see you have many options here first you can have the option to change the uh, the face shape According to what your face is and you can change the hairstyle depending on what hairstyle you like then next if you want to have a longer hair at the back you can choose it from here and next you can choose the facial expression whatever facial expression you want for the transition you can choose it from here you can have a happy smile an anger angry smile a sad smile okay and then next the eyes you can choose from the many eyes options from the gallery so which eyes will suit your eyes so that it will match the real you next you can choose the uh, eyebrow your many eyebrows here so choose for what uh, will suit you then the lips or mouth you can choose what uh, what mouth then the ear you can choose many ears here so pointed rounded okay next you can choose the mustache okay so if you have a mustache you can choose which what kind of mustache you have then you can put some like band-aid or any earrings then if you have if you have mole you can choose here then next can choose uh, if you want to put some eyeglasses okay if you are used uh, really use sunglasses or eyeglasses you can put it here then you have many options for the costume so I'm using here Superman you can also choose whatever you can choose Ninja Naruto and here you can choose the headgear the headgear so you can choose the headphone so I'm using headphone next can choose the background so you have many options here you can just transparent or you have no background you can choose the color and you can adjust the colors that just just touch the the rounded button at the right side of the avatar okay then i will be using the transparent option because i will be using it to uh, 
from my avatar in here you can have the uh, the hand signals or whatever uh, gestures you want for your avatar you can choose it here so from transition to transition you will have to decide what transition you want for the hands okay then after you choose the right combination you will have to save it then before you uh, after you click the save button you will have to put the name so here you can put the uh, the name of your avatar like Kuya Vince number one because you will be doing many avatar like if you're going to use three four avatar for your transition then you will have to make main gesture and save it and name it like one two three or four okay Then if you already uh, created your avatar, like uh, if you are male and if you are female, you have already uh, created your avatar and the transition, the different kind of gestures for your avatar, then you will have to uh, decide whether it is 1, 2, 3, 4 or if you, can have, if you want to make like up to 6 avatar for the different kind of transition you want for your introduction. So these are the, sim the sample of the different avatars that you can uh, use now we will open our kind master and start a new project 16 by 9 ratio now we will select a background you can uh, click the media and you can uh, select from the background already given by kind master or you can upload your own background you can select your own picture but for our tutorial today, we will use the gray background. So we will have to adjust the length of the background depending on how long we want the introduction will be. Next, we'll have to go to layer, the media. Then I'll have to select from the gallery the uh, saved avatar that we have created. So we'll choose one by one. Right now, we're going to select the uh, avatar that we already uh, saved from the uh, avatar one so that's right then you'll have to select the second avatar we'll have to adjust the length of the avatar how long do we want it to play so we can make it at like two seconds one seconds or longer okay now select the second avatar up to the three up to the fourth or how many avatars you want to put in your introduction Next, we will have to select from the layer, then uh, overlay, or if you have a media, uh, say because we will have to put the nameplate below the avatar. So you can choose from the overlay, or you can use uh, the media if you have a saved picture like table or nameplate or name tag that you will be putting under your avatar. So now we will be choosing something from the skull overlay so like a uh, paper that's what we're going to use so that's now we are choosing the paper okay so we will adjust it and we will put it under the avatar so right now we can adjust the size resize it how long we want it to be how big it is 
how wide it is so that's all for the uh, name plate area for our avatar okay we will have to move our avatar upwards so that it can uh, put properly above the uh, the paper or the name plate that we are going to put our name so we'll have to adjust it one by one the avatars the pictures of your avatar okay once we already put in place our avatar then we'll have to move the name plate okay we will have to stretch out up to the end Next, we are going to put another layer which is our name so we'll have to click the layer then text then we will have to type the name that we want like for me it's Kuya Vince so you can use what you want to use for your name then we will have to put it above the plate okay or the paper paper name tag there then we can adjust the uh, the font the type of the font and we can also adjust uh, what color we want it to be so we have to click the color we can choose red or some green or anything you want any color you want so that's it we will have to click the animation in animation so we will have to click the uh, letter by letter so that it will be look it will look like something that you are writing above it or typewriting above it so we can adjust the speed we can make it uh, faster or we can make it slower so that it will uh, like an actual writing style Then we will adjust our name up to the end of the background. That's it. Now since we already put in place in everything, we will have to click the audio. We want to put some music. If we want to put some uh, sound effects. We can choose from the uh, library of our audio. If you have a save audio, you have save sound effects. You have save songs for your introduction. You can choose from there, or you can download from the uh, store of Kind Master. You can put some like thumb mark, like stamp pad, like audience, everything you want uh, to put or you want to use sound effects and uh, songs. You can download it from the library or audio library of uh, Skyn Master want to add some pictures you can click the layer add media then you can choose from your downloaded pictures like uh, for me I will be using a, a picture from YouTube I already downloaded it should be a it should have a transparent background like that then you can adjust the size you can uh, shift it like that you can slant it you can put it beside the avatar then also you can use the in animation you can put some in animation how you want it to uh, the entrance of your picture so like this we will have to select like the rubber stamp so it will look like a rubber stamp then we can adjust the speed if you want it to normal slow down okay and then you can adjust it up to the end of the background
next if you want to add another uh, layer so we have click layer media then go to our downloaded pictures like for me I already have the downloaded pictures like uh, we will have to select something for the subscribe button so we'll have to do look for the subscribe button that we already downloaded from the internet right now so uh, I'm searching for it so it's in the, under the pix art so right now okay so we'll have to select the subscribe button then we'll have to uh, slant it the angle we have to select the angle the right angle okay then adjust it the next are animation so we'll have to select again the rubber stamp so that it will match our YouTube picture then we have to adjust the length of it up to the end of the background so it will uh, once you are playing it it will appear up to the end of your introduction okay add another option so you can put some at the end of the uh, introduction you can put some uh, transition so before putting transition you can select a background can select the color like black so we'll select the color black put it the end of the uh, of the introduction you can adjust the length of it then if you want to put some transition you have to click the uh, the part where it is bricked okay so the, the part before the uh, the black background and the gray background you can see the white okay that's the break so you have to click it so you will have to click it to let the uh, transition effect appear so you have to select some uh, of the uh, transition that you want so for me I'm uh, I selected the one I already downloaded from the uh, library of the kind master so it's up to you what you want to use what transition transition effect you want to use at the end or at, at the end or at the beginning of your introduction so after you put anything or any effects or whatever sounds you want to or whatever pictures you want to add to your introduction to your avatar introduction now you have to uh, export it so that it will turn into an mp4 so you can immediately attach it to any videos that you are going to upload in youtube okay so i hope that you learned something from me in how to make an introduction using avatar that uh, looks exactly like you so this is it thank you so much for uh, watching and i hope that you learned something from me this is Koya Vince and good day